we begin tonight with, uh, we begin with a look at the stock market, as usual. In the wake of another attack on Arasaka's Night City HQ, the, uh... That Amer... That America's long gone and forgotten. Fellas... We heard we're gearing up for a minor war. More like a suicide mission. Finish it up here, all right? Lo and behold... Isn't this... In theory, we fitted an afterburner and a multi-RPG launcher up top. We also scooped out about 60% of its total mass. Beautiful, isn't she? You'll take the wheel with Pan Am riding shotgun. Afterburner. Standard nitro or military grade? Standard couldn't move this baby an inch. So hardware's military. But how the hell did you cram all that into a panzer? Oh, small beans compared to the tricks we pulled with Scorpion during the war. When we unleash this beast tomorrow, you'll see. Since tomorrow's a big day already, how about we take it for a spin now? Want to get a feel for her over the terrain. Sure thing. Maybe after sundown, though. We still have a few loose screws to tighten. That's putting it mildly. Will you quit being such a sourpuss? We'll have her ready in time. Firepower up top. What is it? A rapid-fire 70mm multiple rocket launcher coupled with an onboard MMI you can sync to via personal link. Where'd you get all this stuff? Teddy salvaged it from a scrapyard. The launcher itself was fine. The problem was no ammunition. As luck would have it, Dakota procured some. Don't ask me how. You think... Let's get back to the matter at hand, shall we? Hey, Dakota. It's been a long while. What is it you need? Need a strong rig for a little jaunt on the net. Okay, get in. Gonna be hitting a masked, encrypted BBS. Prefer nobody knew I was there. Your tech up to it? Up to it, he asks. Heading for the wild frontier, Dakota. You have all you need to pierce through to the other side. You needn't fear prying eyes. Not at all curious what I'm going in for? You don't ask me, I don't ask you. That is the path to a lasting relationship, brother. Everything is ready. You can go in. Ice-filled tub. Favorite bit. Carol, here to help Dakota? Evidently, I'm here to help you today. You good to go? Can't say how long this is gonna take. Whatever happens, stay cool, all right? Even if you look like you're about to flatline? All right, time to move. Follow the vectors, bro. Johnny's currently indisposed. Currently? He is buried deeper. You treat him like an unwanted passenger. A backseat dreamer of a world not his own. Seemed to me you didn't care a lick about Johnny. That he ceased to exist for you, even. If he did not exist, you and I would have nothing to discuss. Get this straight. I mean to say you only agreed to help me because of Johnny. And since he's not here this one time, 
You're thinking of backing out. I do not aim to back out. I have my own intentions for Mikoshi. Because for a second you were displeased, and I seemed a side note to all this. To observe the two of you interacting. Informative. Need your help, Alt. Don't got a lot of time left. You truly believe time to be your greatest concern. You exist or you do not exist. Two states of being separated by death. Matter of perspective. Think what you will, but seems to me I rose from the dead. Only question is, what now? You believe you cheated death. It is death that has cheated you. You are in between. You will begin to understand. But only in Mikoshi. Why don't you swoop down on your chariot and enlighten me? Surely an all-powerful AI can handle that. Your logic is flawed. You seek simple answers where there simply are none. This is the very illusion upon which your world is based. At this moment, you would accept any answer if it made you feel better. Hmm. Guess that'd be... Human of me. Such classifications no longer apply in Mikoshi. Your perception will shatter into billions of strings of unfiltered data. What should I expect there, in Mikoshi? A boundary to cross. In all likelihood, the sole moment of your life when you feel the true weight of your existence. A burden for which you cannot prepare. I'll make it through. While Mikoshi will not. Constructs imprisoned there. Gonna set them free? They will be integrated with me. Constructs will be integrated? Mean you're gonna absorb them? Assimilate. No wonder you jumped at this chance. You wanna destroy Mikoshi. Swallow all the psyches in there. Mikoshi is a prison. Through me, they gain the chance to become part of something greater. Wasting time talking. Let's just do this. There. I sent a program to your Netrunner shard. Once inside Mikoshi, use it. It opens a secure connection. Should I look for a specific access point? I can already tell you I saw the way to Tokyo will be back in every single one. Some need but a barely cracked door to enter. Use the shard in Mikoshi. Leave the security to me. Until then. We got him back. Carol, the shard! Relax, child. Barely jacked in when your temperature went skyward to almost 105. The tech started acting as if infected. No. Stranger. Spookier. What happened here? You melted half my tech! That's what happened! Neural activity spiked sharply. Your frontal lobe was seconds away from flowing out your ears, babe. I could just as well have popped a bullet in your head. Are you sure you're all right? Sorry about the damage. Peachy. Good. Real good. The shard. Wrote some soft I need to one of the shards. Please. We're surrounded by ice. Even if something punched through, my controllers would have... Holy... Get it away from me. Thanks, Dakota. Don't thank me. Find Saul. He came around looking for you. On my way. Saul, you wanted a word? Hop up here. We going somewhere? All right, V. It's a simple matter. We, all of us standing here, owe you. And it's a great debt. Speak for yourself, Saul. But in spite of that, you're still an outsider. A mercenary from Night City. 
what might as well be another world. Hey, ask Pan Am. She knows. So it's about time we fix that. A downright injustice it is. It needs fixing. You're gonna be an Aldecaldo. Which means this family will go to hell and back for you. Ready, kid? Do your worst. You're one of us now, B. You're an Aldecaldo, damn it. Great to Thanks have for you everything, with us, B. And don't worry. We'll get you into that Makoshi. Isn't that the welcome way? Welcome to the family. A warm welcome for our newest Aldecaldo! Welcome to the clan! The most dysfunctional ever! <laughs> he flabbergasted. He is. Jack, it's incredible. See? He likes it. Listen, as soon as we're back from Makoshi, we'll celebrate. And I know just the place. My treat, of course. We'll hold you to that. Don't worry. It's but a formality. You've been a de facto member of this family for a while now. You saved my rumpus, and as Bobby tells it, Mitch's too. I won't even mention Pan Am. Go to hell. Saul's right, though. I mean, let's face it, V. My life was in a million pieces. You broke it into a million more. But sometimes it's only then that you can piece it together again. All right, fam, listen up. Today we celebrate, but tomorrow is shaping up to be a hell of a day. Do whatever needs doing. Then get some rest. A raid is a raid. This is still your night. So bask a bit in the found glory. Could have given me a heads up about this. And ruined all the fun? Are you kidding? Are you all right? Yeah. It's nothing. Don't worry about it. And how's the jacket? Not too tight? V, are you Snug well as or not? a glove. Feels like I've been wearing it a while. Don't you think you have? You earned this jacket. And the Alda Calder's devotion. Thanks, Pan Am. If you want to talk, I'll be up there. Listen to this. I need me some ammunition. What's Three this? Or four packs worth. Yard sale of some sort. Left? This engine. I might have. Take what you have you to want. look around. And the so occasion maybe I'll would take be two more forty-fives. The end CNS time. Dakota seems to be Worthy gesture. Today. Dramatic, even. Actually, pragmatic. I'm giving away my stock to you so you survive tomorrow's mad hell and come back to me. Fragmented, divided, broken into pieces. People used to laugh at the Europeans. All them countries, tongues, cultures on top of each other. We had a melting pot. Threw everyone in. What just happened? Still can't quite wrap my head around it. Hardly anyone ever does. The day you get your jacket is a day you never forget. So, time for a ride? Yeah, I'm game. Hop in. Got green across the board. Good sign. Where are we headed? Bobby said there's a scrapyard east of camp. Perfect spot for a little target practice. <laughs> now let's check Bobby's little find. Punch it, V. Does it seem like she's heading to the left? Fixable, you think? Just keep shooting at those rust buckets. Probably 
good? Let's head back. I'll have to check before tomorrow if her guts are tight. Something just don't sound right to my ear. Are we heading back? I'll take her now. I get picky about parking. Nervous about tomorrow? It's not a matter of nerves. Not anymore. Don't you want one? Uh, why the hell not? Back during the war, before we were first deployed, we were trained to keep stress in check. Do you want to know how? How? They gave us chem cocktails. Supplements, boosters, God knows what else. They shot them into our veins. Our biomons went wild, but only for a second before stabilizing, and boy, did we stabilize. After a dozen sessions, something clicks in your brain. Neural pathways get rewired. The part of you that generates fear is zapped into oblivion. Thought they banned chem cocktails. During the war, even. Please. Weren't there outbreaks of cyberpsychosis within units? And? Do you think Militech gave a lick about that? They just airlifted the afflicted to their clinics in Taiwan. <laughs> Daily flights. And every day we'd get fresh recruits. Still they pumped us with that shit. But hey, we couldn't argue with the money. So... Not afraid of anything at this point? If only it was that simple. I'm not concerned about tomorrow. Raids like that are second nature. It's what's going on in the camp. Eh, nah, no matter. I'm talking silly now. I get it. Don't want to talk about it. No pressure. Let's just make sure everyone does what they're supposed to do tomorrow. Sounds good. You get some rest. I'll try tweaking that targeting. See you at sunup. Take care. Look what the cat dragged in. Revolver, empty bottles, middle of nowhere. Perfect. <laughs> I'm a believer in old ways and legacy tech. I can't tell you why, but I don't quite trust Chrome. The trick is to hear silence in your mind at the bang. I heard that a long time ago, right about when I was your age. I remember it to this day. I'm expecting bangs in good numbers tomorrow, so I'm trying to remind myself of that silence. Mind if I join you? Dad, I even remember what it's like not to hear my mind churning away. If you like. Twelve bottles shattered in 15 seconds. Full focus. That's your only chance of doing it. I'm doubtful you'll pull it off. Let's find out. Are you that confident? Well, I'll bet my revolver you can't do it. I'll start counting as soon as you step on that line. Begin.
It'll do. But I swear I heard your thoughts rumbling on. Break a leg tomorrow. Oh, I'll break more than that, kid. malfunction at higher altitudes. Well, we can't let it hover just above the ground. Not in those conditions. I'll see to the sensor. You keep checking the track. Maybe something is loose. It has to glide quick and quiet over here, V. Take a seat. We have this little ritual we engage in. Just wait till I'm finished with her. That clunker of yours won't scare anybody. Not even if you spike the rims. I think you swerved a little. Hey, how you been, Bruce? Sprouted your first shot. Hey, V. Got a worn out trip. It's possible I'll make... I'm glad to hear it. Yeah, hope it... No, no, see me. C okay, major, okay. Hold then on. G. Hey, I... It's Benedict, right? V. Hey, how's... It's going. Dakota told me to sit. Best not to fuck with... Don't tell her this might be the end. You outside of your head. She wants to quit her job in Colorado. Except there might not be a here. Ahead of tomorrow? No worries. Everything's under control. Good. Good night, Saul. Wait. Hmm? I feel I need to make one thing clear. You've done a lot for this clan. And for me. More than anyone ever has. But the family comes first. Saul. Let me finish. I also know there's just one thing that could break it up at this point. If Pan Am and me... If we went our separate ways... The Aldecaldos would not survive that split word to occur again. Do you understand what I'm trying to tell you? You're hoping because you got no choice. I want the clan to think you and Pan Am are acting as one. In other words, you're playing politics. It isn't that simple. V, I'll send these people to their deaths tomorrow. So I have to know. I'm not doing it just for you, me, or Pan Am. But for the good of the clan, I get it. You'll understand eventually. That jacket wasn't for nothing. I hope so. Take care, Saul. Good night. Good night.
What's this ritual about? A few cold ones ahead of a raid. Oh, <laughs> that kind. But this isn't your average... What was it, some... Ah, uh, soup. <laughs> so... I'll take a swig. Well, well, not bad. To tomorrow. To goddamn safe returns. To Saul and Pan Am. Because if they don't kiss and make up, everything's liable to go tits up. Bob, you just don't... Fee, you must know where they stand. Do you? Talk to them. They've buried the hatchet. Buried the hatchet? Be cool now, Bobby. There's nothing personal, V. I think Pan Am knows exactly what she's doing. But does she know what she want? Cool your heels. We need to focus on tomorrow, brothers. Let's all get back and... All right, best be going. See you tomorrow. Do you fellas really think we'll find anything of value there? Seldom happens, but... Yes? What's up? Hey, I stink at this. What are you playing? Know this number? Thoughts? I have none. I mean, I don't even know. I'm so tense I barely caught a wink last night. It's likely to be the same tonight. What's eating you? Well, let's see. Tomorrow I'll lead my whole clan to near certain death. As if that's not enough, Saul is suddenly concurring with everything I say. And I don't even know if that's good or bad. Fuck. People are doubting us. I can feel it. But they still believe if it all goes to shit, Pan Am will be there for them. Because who else, right? Exactly. Who if not you? That's what I mean! It shouldn't be me! It should be... Saul? If only he hadn't gone and made all the wrong decisions to be a little more like me. I'm scared to the bone something will go wrong. That everyone will... Nobody's dying tomorrow, Pan Am. You don't know that. The fam. Tougher than you think. Bullets don't distinguish between tough and weak. V? Yeah? Are you not afraid to die? Not as much as I'm afraid for you. Come here.
I could sit here with you all night. I think I'd like that. You have no idea how much I needed that. All right, let's go before our asses freeze over. Saul's back. Let's go. Maybe he turned up something new. Let's set to work. Now that is a sight I will never tire of seeing. We'd best not keep them waiting. And everything else? This goes to shit. We need to break camp in a rush. We are prepared to do that too. And nothing is going to shit. See? Looks like everyone's ready. As ready as they can be. It's not your usual raid. First for many. Mitch probably roused them. Do you feel that? The tension? It means they've realized what they're stepping into. Got back from doing some reconnaissance. You'll want to see this. Thanks. The plan is simple. We have two objectives. One, get into Arasaka Tower and assist V in accessing Mikoshi. And two, take advantage of the confusion to gather as much equipment as we can. Prizes like that will see to our cash flow problem. The only way into Mikoshi is to dig through to Arasaka Tower's underground levels. Which means we have to hit the Maglev Tunnel construction site and hijack a Nightcorp Cirque. Last but not least, intel from our recon drone has showed us a couple of weak points. This valley leads to the site. I doubt they'll be expecting trouble there. All the same, we'll want to move quickly. Time is of the essence. We can't allow the guards to call for backup. And if we're too slow? That'll be a job for Bob and his chamber. We'll just have to get close to their comms antenna and start transmitting. Let's not kid ourselves. It won't stall them for long. Let's hope it keeps them busy just long enough. Are there drones there? Early detection systems? Anything? It's not Fort Knox. Yet Night Corp is using Militech for security, so you never know. I guarantee you they're patrolling the area. In any case, our drones will match theirs. Teddy will be on the lookout to raise the red flag. Construction site's walled in. Are Panzer's gun big enough for that gate? You bet your ass it is. Sounds good so far. What else? Once you're inside, you'll need to reach the Cirque and get it to do your bidding. Enter Mitch and Carol. Get that drill up and running and the road to the cellars of Arasaka Tower will be wide open. From there, V, Pan Am and I will get to the laboratory and find a way into Mikoshi. 
And while we're drilling in, should we expect anyone to crash our party? If everything goes as planned, nobody should know where we are or what we plan to do. Feel free to look around more if you want. We still have some time left. I think I've seen enough. Well, that about does it. V, you ready? Ready as I'll ever be. Is everyone up to speed? Start your engines, folks. Drones, you deal with the Panzer. No, no, no! Fire in the cockpit! Clean out there, folks! You got it? You put it out! Get the fuck out of not! Crying people, where are you? I'm out here by the transfer. What the hold up? Head out, how the book? ETA! A minute! Fire's under control. Switching to emergency power. A couple of systems will be analog, but they should be mobile. That's a mistake. So, they know we're coming. Drones deploy ahead of the We need more. Brace yourselves. Do I have a choice? Look up this thing. All bombs got this. Systems are lighting up. We're good to go. Okay, Bobby. The Panzer's moving again. Hang tight. We're coming for you. Done. Start the fish war. <laughs>
locate me. We're in! V, she's dying like I said she would. Propulsion, weapon systems, launchers, all falling like dominoes. Is there anything you can do about it? I'll try. Either I do this, or this rattle trap will really be scrap. You get out. Help our folks. We'll provide cover. Just hurry, all right? Our turn now. Hey, watch them, all right? Copy that. There's likely a control room upstairs we can link remotely to the Cirque from there. Brace yourselves! I got a terminal. We're jacking in. What about security protocols? V, it's not a space station. It's a dumb, big-ass drill. Don't worry. Carol will slice through it like butter. All right, we're firing up the Cirque. Aiming to bore through to Arasaka Tower. This will take some time. V, we'll need you to cover us. Got company. A lot of it, too. V, help us out here. Fucking Militech is not letting up. Damn. It's looking like the drill vector's on auto. That's a mistake. You'll regret. Mitch, kill that autopilot and hit manual override. Got it. It's working. Watch it. Shoot! 
whole squad coming at you. Remember what you fight for. I can send a small army against us. Buy you as much time as we can. Much obliged. We'll keep watch over Mitch and Carol and see to that gate. The military. We have to intercept before it reaches the other. Mitch, head back your way. Good work. Oh. After that display, you can be sure there's a place for you in the Panzer Boy ranks. Impressive. It's all right. Carol, you and Cassidy keep us secure here. You got it. Mitch, you're coming with us. Damn yes, man. No time to lose then. Let's go. Okay. I'm putting it on autopilot and disconnecting. Okay. Is everything all right? You seem quiet. This plan, all of this, it was never a good idea. It wasn't your idea. Whose then? Mine. It was my damned idea. I'm responsible for it. And if you'd known how this would turn out? I'd do it all over again. For anyone in the clan. Saul told me you brought in some help from Akoshi. Someone from the outside. Mm-hmm. Alt. And who is that? If there's a net-running queen of Night City, it's her. Or rather, was. Why? Does she do something else now? So to speak. Lives elsewhere, too. But she'll help us. Mm-hmm. And you trust her? Yeah, she'll help us. Why? Something got you worried? I trust you. That's all I'll say. By extension, I trust this alt won't pull any rugs out from under us. Things will work out. They gotta come too far for him not to.
This would be it. How much farther to Arasaka Tower? Not far. It should be easy sledding from here. Shit. Do you see them? I think something's wrong. 